No application needed at all. Um, the principles of Wolf are about values, about treating with each other with respect, about hearing each other's ideas. I mean, it's, it's built on that foundation. Um, so it's actually quite self-policing in terms of that. And the people that are going to get involved in this are people that really want to make a difference. Um, so the sales pitch, even back then, um, was how would you like to get involved in a movement that really lets the voices that haven't been heard be heard? And there's women and men, but we're going to reinvent companies for growth using our voices, and we're going to build this global network. And that, when you start talking especially to women, there's a lot of men that got involved too. That's not a hard sell. I mean, we've never done an advertising campaign. We've never, because it's all viral. It happens virally. And they just come. I mean, we have these events, and they're posted right now on my Facebook account, and also I'm building a website to get it up and launched. But that's, it's not quite there yet. It's just a splash page if you went out there. Wolf means business. And, and I had to do that quickly because behind the splash page, if you go out there now, and there's a button that says Get Involved in Wolf, click on that, and it take, comes up to a contact page where you enter your information. Because since I've been gone from Best Buy, the network has grown by 5,000 in three and a half months. So how I was handling that up until I got that page up is they were emailing me, saying, I want to be involved in this. And I was literally copy-pasting their email into Excel. And I have, if you looked at my computer, it's a mess because I've got states and countries and I've got the London list and I'm putting it on there. I'm going, I'm putting it on Amsterdam or Turkey or wherever. And so the, the website is coming soon. You'll see it if you go back out there in about three weeks. Um, you'll see a brand new Wolf website. Um, all the ways to participate will be there. So the packs are only one way, um, the Omega packs, Wolf packs, and so on. And um, I'm right now working with Ning and other companies that are in the social space to build the Wolf Den, which is a place for people that are involved to be able to go virally online and actually be pulled into a net to do innovation online for companies. So how that works today is I literally send an email out to London, as an example, because I have how many teams do we have? Five teams who are kicking off their next week, the 30th, at the House of Parliament. Uh, five teams of women. The email went out saying, if you know somebody or if you happen to be passionate about these five subjects, the first 15 women to send me an email, you're on the team. That's how I construct the teams. So it's based on passion. If you don't have passion, you're not going to get involved. And if you don't have passion, we don't want you to get involved. Either get on a different team or wait because we'll be launching more teams. Or just come to the networking events or the give back. So in London, what we're doing right now is we're launching these teams on the 30th. So if you're in London, come join us because we're going to have cocktails after. Um, and it's to build a movement in the UK to educate girls and women and boys how to b build leadership skills to get into politics. Which is serendipitous that now the MP scandal is going on, so everybody's stepping down. And so we're getting a lot of media attention and the people that are getting involved in these wolf packs are people in very high positions. Um, so Gordon, Gordon Brown, speechwriter, is working with us from 10 Downing Street. And we have um, a woman that's on the Queen's Court on an innovation team, um, reinventing the future so that we have more equal voice in politics. And we're doing the same thing in, the, in New York. We just launched the teams last week. Well, first of all, I want to thank you um, for taking out the time today, a whole day, to spend um, with each other. I guess being new to Best Buy, it brought me into a community and gave me a sense of family. Women getting together of all different races, all different backgrounds, like coming together as one and trying to do one thing together. We love to collaborate. We love to listen. But most importantly, we love to build and use relationships to influence others. We've raised over $20,000 to put back into our community, all because of you guys. One big pack, which is wool. This is awesome. I'm looking out here and I go, there is no shortage of female leaders. We might have a shortage of women in leadership positions, but we have no shortage of female leaders.
You're very, very gifted men and women, very gifted men and women, and we've got to hang in there together. And I loved it when your other colleagues spoke and told their stories, but I hope no matter what you do, get involved in the community in any way you can, because folks, we need one another. Thank you, God bless you, and go for it. I think I made the statement that was something like, oh, sure, I'm glad I'm not one of those managers that creates that boys club. <laughs> and I said that because I was sort of looking for affirmation, right? And I didn't necessarily got the response that I was looking for, because the, the response I was looking for was, yeah, Posh, you're right. You never did that. But that wasn't what I got. One thing that we like to use as a guiding principle on our network will is, is, is it somebody that you could call at 2 a.m. and say, please come bail me out of jail? It really wants you to be a better person and help others be better people. As I sit back and listen to people network and, and, and listen to stories and, and build relationships, I can't think of any other event or forum that would be better to, to harness that kind of enthusiasm and excitement. I just really want to talk about unleashing the power of women and that's truly really what it was about. That what it's really about now is paying it forward, paying it to those around you and together making a huge difference. There's a fire that's been started here that nobody's going to turn off.